Unit 1.4, Forms of Business Organizations. Um, there are different uh, forms of business organizations. Uh, you must have seen small businesses, big businesses, but each, um, are, uh, each form of business has its own structure. And uh, in finance, we classify them into broadly um, four. And no, I'm sorry, three different types, and four different types, right? So in finance, we broadly classify them into four different types. So let us discuss each one of them one by one. The first type of business structure or business form that we will discuss is sole proprietorship. A sole proprietorship is a business owned by only one person. It is easy, it, it, let me explain you. Um, you must have seen in your, um, in your, your home, or a very small uh, general store, okay? And um, uh, you must have seen a tuition center, okay? a coaching center, or um, you must have seen um, different, uh, a small photocopy shop, okay? a place where people go and get their photocopy needs done. So these are all small, small businesses which are owned by a single person. So these all businesses are actually referred as sole proprietorship. Now, what are the characteristics of these businesses? They are very easy to set up. Because a single person has decision making, no conflict, no conflict, very easy to set up. And um, it's, it's also less costly because in the initial state, it is a very small business. But um, the disadvantage is that it, uh, the owner faces unlimited liability. For example, if there is one single person who is starting a new bakery, a new sort of a bakery, I would say a unique kind of a bakery. And if he has taken the loan from a bank, he is the only one who has to return all the loan. So this kind of business uh, has advantages and also has some disadvantages. The disadvantages that um, it has uh, it has unlimited liability okay and um, it is uh, usually a small business acha isme ye hota hai ki agar aap apni liability time pe puri nahi kar pate theek hai agar aap apna loan time pe pura nahi kar pate to your personal assets can uh, also be sold theek hai agar aapne apne kisi apna aap for example aapke paas apna chota sa bungalow hai aur aapne uske papers deke mortgage loan jo hota hai wo aapne liya hai to start a business and if you are <coughs> unable to pay back, Back on time, so uh, the bank is going to seal your uh, bank loan, or then they can sell it. So this is a little disadvantage of this business. The another uh, type of business is a partnership. A partnership is a business owned by two or more person who contribute resources into the entity. The partners divide the profit of the business among themselves. In general partnership, all partners have unlimited liability. In limited partnership, creditors cannot go after the personal assets of the limited partners. Okay, a partnership concept business hota hai, that is owned by at least two people, okay, and they are the owner of the business. And uh, and um, uh, basically, do log, do, you must have seen two friends milke koi business start kar lete hai, ya, uh, do bhai hai, wo milke koi business start kar lete hai. So these kind of businesses are actually called partnership. Is me yota hai ki do ya teen log jinon ne milke business start kiya, they all bring up whatever they have who apna sara kuch laate aur business mein lagate theek hai resources wo apne share karte hain aapas mein jo profit hota hai wo bhi tamam partners mein distribute hota hai the another type of a business is corporation theek hai corporation is actually that refers to big businesses theek hai jisme aapke paas rakit bikinger hai aapke paas Jo Bisare Bare Bare Gulamad, I'm not sure is Gulamad 
private or public but in order to be a corporation you needed to uh, you you needed to float your stocks into the market theek hai corporation se murad ye hai ki aapne apne stocks market mein float lazmi karne hote hain theek hai so it basically means that corporations are all um, public limited companies okay aapko agar kisi corporation mein ownership chahiye तो so, आपको उसके शेयर्स खरीदने होंगे ठीक है बड़े बिजनेसेस होते हैं ह्यूज बिजनेसेस एंड इनके स्टॉक्स भी मार्केट में फ्लोट हो रहे होते हैं जिसमें आपके पास बैंक्स आ गए सारे बड़े बड़े बैंक्स हैं आपके पास ये सारा का सारा आपका लकी का जो है ये लकी सीमेंट लकी इंडस्ट्रीज आ गया देन यू हैव दिस पेट्रोलियम सेक्टर आपका पी एस ओ हो गया शेल हो गया ठीक है सो दीज आर ऑल बेसिकली बिग कंपनीज दे आर रेफर एज कॉपरेशन और उनके स्टॉक्स मार्केट में शेयर कर रहे होते हैं इसमें इनका फायदा ये होता है कि दे डू नॉट हैव एनी लाइबिलिटी ऑन देयर ओनर्स बेसिकली इनके पास कोई ओनर्स होते ही नहीं है दे हैव अ बोर्ड ऑफ डायरेक्टर्स जो इनको रन कर रहा होता है देर इज नॉट एनी ओनर ऑफ दिस बिजनेस बट येस देर कैन बी अ फाउंडर जिसने वो बिजनेस स्टार्ट किया होगा बट फाउंडर इज नो मोर द ओनर बिकॉज द बिजनेस इज अ पब्लिक लिमिटेड बिजनेस सो हु इज अ ओनर द ओनर इज अ पब्लिक जिन जिनके पास भी इनके स्टॉक्स होंगे दीज आर ऑल ओनर्स ओके सो लाइबिलिटी इसमें लिमिटेड होती है जो बोर्ड ऑफ डायरेक्टर्स होते हैं अगर उन्होंने कोई लोन लिया भी है बिजनेस को फर्दर ग्रो करने के लिए तो वो उस पर्टिकुलर ईयर में डिविडेंड्स कम अनाउंस करेंगे लोन पे ऑफ कर देंगे एंड यू नो देर देर इज अ कम्प्लीट सिस्टम दैट ऑपरेट्स द कॉपरेशन एंड द लास्ट वन इज कॉपरेटिव अ कॉपरेटिव इज अ बिजनेस ऑर्गेनाइजेशन दैट इज ओन बाय द ग्रुप ऑफ इंडिविजुअल एंड इज ऑपरेटेड फॉर द म्यूचुअल बेनिफिट्स ऑफ द पीपल ओके दीज आर एक्चुअली दोज ऑर्गेनाइजेशन जो लोगों के बेनिफिट के लिए काम करती है जिसमें आप की यूटिलिटी प्रोवाइडर्स आ गए आपके वाटर वाटर प्रोवाइडर इलेक्ट्रिसिटी प्रोवाइडर गैस प्रोवाइडर आ जाते हैं आपके ठीक है आपके डिफरेंट हाउसिंग कॉपरेटिव आ जाते हैं आपके पास क्रेडिट यूनियंस आ जाते हैं एंड सो ऑन थैंक यू